Hey everyone, how are you doing? It's me Jens from the Wondershare Demo Creator team and I'm going to be your host today. Maybe there will come a point in life or maybe there has been this point in life already for you where you had to screen record something for others to see, be it for a school project, educational purposes in general or maybe for something that you need to create for your company. And especially during the ongoing pandemic, screen recorders have become more and more important over time than ever before. And by far the biggest advantage about screen recordings is the fact that you can transport audio-visual information to someone, for example a viewer. They can watch you go through certain instructions and they can follow along. And they can replay, for example, this screen recording. And this is what we are going to talk about today. How to screen record with your PC using Wondershare's Demo Creator and especially if you have a low-end PC, how you can still record your screen in some way. And if you are new to the Wondershare Demo Creator channel, definitely make sure to subscribe to the channel by clicking the little subscribe button down there, as well as to activate the little notification bell. That way you are going to stay updated about future features that come to Wondershare's Demo Creator, as well as certain giveaways and videos that I created here on this channel. So definitely make sure to become a member of the channel. Like mentioned at the start of the video, we are going to deal with the fact today that some users might only have a low NPC or a 32-bit system and are not sure if they can actually screen record something because of the poor performance of the system in general. And for this purpose I would like to introduce Wondershare's demo creator to you today, which is on the one hand a very minimalistic and user-friendly, but on the other hand, and more importantly for this video, a very resource-friendly screen recording and video editing software, which you can try out for completely free by taking a look at the link at the top of the description. So if you are completely new to the channel, make sure to download Wondershare's demo creator at first and then keep watching the video for more instructions. But before we dive into the how to edit and how to record videos in general, we must at first take a look at the system requirements that you have to fulfill to run Wondershare's Demo Creator. And the good thing is, spoilers ahead, it runs on both Windows and Mac, which is really good. Those are the both most used um, operating systems on Earth and Wondershare's Demo Creator can be run on both of those. Let us take a look at the specs, shall we? If we take a look at the website of Wondershare's Demo Creator, you can find the respective links down there in the description too. You are going to notice that Wondershare's Demo Creator is compatible from Windows 7 upwards on both 32 and 64 bit systems. But as mentioned previously, it can not only be run on Windows but also on Mac OS from the versions 10.13 upwards to 11. And now that we are done with all the specification stuff that you need to fulfill in order to run Wondershare's Demo Creator, we are going to dive into how to actually record videos and after that I'm going to give you a small glimpse into how to edit videos too. And by the way, you can not only record your instructional videos using Wondershare's Demo Creator, no, you can do way more. You can record gaming videos, um, you can record PowerPoint presentations, online courses for your university, etc. Whatever it is you want to do, you can probably do it using Wondershare's Demo Creator. It comes with such a huge amount of features built in it, even though it's so minimalistic, it's overall such a fantastic program and if you're interested in using the full version, definitely make sure to buy yourself a premium subscription. And now we are going to dive into the details about how to record videos. After you are done downloading Wondershare's Demo Creator, as mentioned before, you are going to open it up and then just click on the new recording button. After you clicked on it, the recording interface is going to pop up immediately and now you can start setting up all the things that you need to set up before getting started with recording the video, meaning what part of the screen you actually want to record. Do you want to record your own voice? Do you want to record your own face? Etc. Etc. All of this can be set up in Wondershare's Demo Creator quite easily. And let us go ahead and get started with the screen part that you want to record. For that, you can either record the full screen, so just click on the full screen down here, or you can drag on the corners to reduce the size of the screen that you want to record. So just want to record a part of the screen, not a problem at all, then you are good to go. Or if you want to record the full screen, as mentioned before, just click on full screen and then you're also good to go. After you're done with that, you can also set up face cam or maybe your own voice, etc. All of this can be easier done if you click on the little gear icon here. After you're done with that, new window is going to pop up and from here on onwards you can go for example to the audio settings. You can either capture your Windows audio, Mac audio, etc. or not. You can either enable it or disable it 
or you can record your own or external microphone. Also, here's a little pro tip. It's helpful to, for example, record using headsets. These have an external microphone attached to it, giving you a better audio quality than most laptop um, microphones, for example. So this is definitely a better option and you should definitely inv invest a bit of money into an external microphone. Just gives you a way better audio quality. Want to record your own face? Just click on the camera right here and set up the camera that you want to record with. And after that you can also set up the resolution of the camera and also the frame rate you want to record with. And also there are a few advanced settings. By the way, if you indeed have a low end PC, definitely make sure to set down the frames per second a tiny little bit when recording. Because this is going to have a bit of less strain on your PC and it's just going to make your overall re recording and after that editing experience a lot better. And also, if you want to record a game of some sort, you can click on Game Capture and if you click on Choose a Game, you can actually choose some kind of application that is running in the background or just a game that you want to record. But we are going to restrict ourselves to screen re recording for now and after you're done with setting everything up just click on capture yet again. And once you are at that window you are going to click on the big red button and then you can start recording everything. And never forget when recording a video it's all about personality and the engagement with the viewer. And people tend to engage more with the person creating the content if they can see their face. It's just a more personal experience and I know this from my YouTube channel just makes people feel better. Um, so definitely make sure to, to show your face, especially if you're some kind of teacher or professor at the university, just as a little tip. And once you're done with recording your session, just once again click on the start recording button right here and it's going to drag you over to the editing interface. And in the editing interface, you can edit everything however you wish. You can cut parts out. You can um, speed parts up. You can add annotations, add text, etc. Emoji, for example. Whatever it is you want to do, you can basically do all of it using Wondershare's Demo Creator. Like mentioned before, a lot of features at a very low price. Just an overall fantastic experience. And this is basically it for today. Just to conclude everything once again and to put the key features of Wondershare's Demo Creator once again into the frame. Wondershare Demo Creator is very easy to use. It has a very user-friendly interface and is extremely um, resource-friendly on your PC. Just overall giving you a very good FPS even if you have a low end PC. Other than that, it gives you a lot of editing and screen recording options. Everything that you are ever going to need is implemented in Wondershare's Demo Creator and just overall it's giving you so many options you are very likely to never use up all of those options, especially if there are new updates to the whole Wondershare Demo Creator program. So yeah, definitely a pretty great deal. And most importantly, you can record your face on audio and also you can create annotations, text, etc. inside of your video when editing, which is just going to give you a way better engagement with your viewers overall, which is a very huge plus. And if you did enjoy what you saw today, then make sure to subscribe to the Wondershare Demo Creator channel to stay updated for future features on Wondershare's Demo Creator, probable giveaways that are going to happen from time to time here on the channel, etc, etc. And you can see more of me if you want. So yeah, that's definitely also pretty cool. This has been Jens from the Wondershare Demo Creator team and I bid you farewell and please stay safe during the pandemic. Ciao!